option A, you just choose one of the following, barbecue, sushi, or hot pot. Option B, you get to get all three options. You can try a little bit of everything we have here. Um, listed on top right here is our soup bases. And then down here is our non-marinated thinly sliced meats. And then everything else will be buffet style. So you can go over there, there'll be marinated meat, steaks, bulgogi, seafood, and also stuff for your hot pot, ramen, vegetables, all sorts of that. And then also the sushi will be over there. And everyone is one stop guy. How's everyone all doing today? Hoping everybody is having a great day today. All right, guys, I'm actually in the city of Roseville, California. And they have this brand new Korean barbecue here, hot pot. All you can eat sushi and everything. Everything is all you can eat, okay? First time here. Let's go inside. Let's check it out. And let me share with you guys. All right, let's go. All right, guys, so like mentioned, I am in Roseville, California. And if you guys don't know where Roseville is, it is actually about 20 minutes away from Sacramento, about two and a half hours away from San Jose, and I would say about seven hours or so from the OC area. All right, so today is actually Valentine's Day. Happy Valentine's to everybody out there. And we're going to be trying out this brand new korean barbecue sushi and hot pot it's called the k-town korean barbecue sushi and hot pot in roseville california all right so this is the menu guys if you guys want to check it out more detail please pause the video All right, guys so i'm gonna be walking around the whole buffet here to show you guys what they have to offer So what do you guys think? Looking real good so far, huh? Alright guys, so we are here at the brand new uh, hot pot, barbecue, all you can eat sushi. Uh, first time here guys, they're soft opening, so you know what that means. We're going to give it a try and let me share with you guys. Alright guys, so like mentioned earlier, today is Valentine's Day and Valentine is considered a holiday, so it's going to be dinner pricing okay guys so monday through friday dinner weekend all day plus holiday for 34.99 adult 17.99 kids and if you guys want to eat lunch it's going to be 23.99 adult 14.99 kid and it is uh, on the menu earlier okay so today guys you have two options okay so we have two options select 
Basically, option A is select one of the following barbecue, sushi, or hot pot. Option B is all three selection, but it is $5 more per person. So today, guys, we're going to go ahead and try out the option A. Next time, we will come back and try option B. But today, we're going to be doing the hot pot all you can eat and if you select one of these options here you have full access to the bar okay as you guys saw earlier they do have a lot of varieties of seafood meat uh, they got some uh, ready to eat food as well i like this the salad section that they had where you can choose your own salad and all that stuff veggies or whatnot and they also have a spot where you guys can make sauces okay so you guys come here you guys can choose their default sauce or you guys can make your own sauce. Alright guys, I forgot to mention that uh, you do have two hour limit for this buffet, okay? And then also earlier mentioned by the staff, if you guys are getting the hot pot, there's going to be a couple of selection of the soup base, okay? So you're going to choose one of those and then you're going to choose your slice of meat. And then if you guys want more meat, you guys can go through uh, to the bar and those are self-serve. And then also we were told that... Uh, if you guys didn't like the type of soup base, you can actually ask them for a different one, okay? So we did chose the number one, which is the tonkatsu. And then we also tried the K-Town house spicy soup. And then I actually changed it to another one, the Thai Tum Yum. Okay, so once again, you guys can change it. If you guys think it's not good or you guys don't like it or whatnot, or you guys just want to try something else, you guys can change the soup. Right, guys so this soup right here is called the k-town house spicy soup all right and it's actually pretty good Alright guys, and I also forgot to mention as well is that if you guys come on their soft opening, you get free soda and you get free sake, which is A+.
all right guys so normally i would give you guys my honest review toward the end of the video but i think i'm gonna go ahead and give you my review right here and after the review uh you guys if you guys like you guys can continue watching the video or you guys can shut it off okay but uh, i'm gonna give you my honest review right now overall guys i'm gonna give this restaurant a solid nine out of ten why guys why a solid nine out of ten first of all the food was really good uh, most of the items were really fresh very tasty very yummy okay and staff were excellent okay they always come by ask us if we need anything else clean off our plates dirty plates and all that stuff and basically they always come back and see if we need anything and then also the place is really clean uh very nice the way they decorate it it's a little dark but uh very nice and romantic as well especially for valentine's day um that's it guys basically this place is really good okay brand new just barely open soft opening and like i mentioned earlier if you guys come during soft opening they're giving out free soda and sake for the uh you know the soft opening and all that stuff so take advantage of it before it goes away right but uh, like I said, overall um, score in this restaurant, very, very good score, very good, everything excellent, a solid nine out of 10. And if you guys know me, if you guys know, I've, and if you guys have been watching, uh, following all my videos, all my food videos or buffets and all that stuff, anything above an eight for me is recommended. I would come back, you know, more times to try more things out. And like I said, um, uh, I will come back and try the option B, which includes all three uh, for $5 more per person. Okay, so I'll try that out next time. So make sure you guys uh, stay tuned, subscribe to the channel if you guys haven't and all that stuff. Uh, overall, like I said, again, it was an excellent experience here today. And also, like I always mention that uh, it is or it depends basically based on the time that I was there, the day that I was there, and all that stuff, okay? So it may be different for you guys, so you guys gotta come try it out for yourself to know. All right, guys, if you guys have any questions or comment, leave them down below. And if you guys haven't subscribed to my channel yet, make sure to hit that subscribe button, okay? And tap in the notification bell, so whenever I upload any new videos, you'll be the first to be notified all right guys so if you guys want to continue watching me eat for the next half an hour or 20 minutes go for it if not just shut off the video but make sure you guys help me out subscribe to the channel thanks guys have a great day take care and thanks for watching bye bye